www.radiosystem.com I'm standing here at the post-fight interview with Marshall. Um, first off, I have to say congratulations. It was a very good event. Numbers, but the fights as well were pretty amazing. Yeah, yeah. I, I think the one thing that we're pretty good at is matching up fights and to bring them in. And when the crowd comes in as early as they did and as passionate as they did, it kind of is the perfect storm. So, yeah, we're real proud of it. I mean, the crowd itself was in a, in a very good mood and some of the results went their way, some of them didn't. One in particular that didn't go their way, Alexander Gustafsson, who beat James Tahuna. What do you, how do you rate his performance? Well, I think what you saw from Tahuna is he's really strong in the clinch. I mean, super strong. Um, I think what ultimately happened, you know, sometimes you rely on that and you end up getting caught. Um, and he did not want to strike with Alexander Gustafsson. Um, I'm a big fan of Jamie's. We're a big fan of Jamie's. Um, it just didn't, wasn't his day today. But, you know, what he's done to donate his purse, you know, to the Queensland, I'm sorry, to the um, New Zealand earthquake. Um, I think I mentioned that we're actually going to match that. Um, these are important things. And for him to be that considerate, you know, at his stage of his career shows a lot of maturity. BJ did the same thing, didn't he? Yeah, he did. He actually is donating to the Queensland um, flood relief. Um, he hasn't yet made a decision on um, you know, how much that is, but I know it's a pretty significant portion of his, um, uh, but I'm going to let him announce that. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, I know for a fact that on the 5th of November, a few venues in both Stockholm and Malmo are booked for the UFC. Is that something you can confirm or not? Um, well, we haven't booked them, but you've got pretty good information. Uh, um, we have, we're holding dates. Uh, but that's pretty common for us. We'll hold dates all around any of the markets we like, um, trying to make sure that if we want to go, we have the opportunity. So I'll be back in Las Vegas next week. We'll sit down, we'll look at our um, schedule for the second half of the year, and we'll see what makes sense. How likely do you think it's going to be? Uh, to be in, in Stockholm or in one of these Sweden. markets or Sweden, yeah. So. Um, I don't know, you know, it's very likely, you know, we've had some really good success speaking with the uh, groups down there to be able to bring the event in. It's one of our biggest markets. Uh, we do great TV ratings. We have a lot of web traffic from there. The, what the event does in any new market, you know, it really starts to solidify us. It lets us have a dialogue with all of the, um, the media and really connect with the fans again. So um, I couldn't put a percentage on it, but I can tell you it's one of the front runners. <laughs> very good. Well, thank you very much. And thank you. I wish you the best of luck. I appreciate the support. Thank Thanks. You. Gymgrossisten.com